this decade, the 2010s will be remembered as the decade of 50-year anniversaries of stuff that happened in the 60s. In fact, I'm going to tweet that. <laughs> the Apollo Project. Oh, no, wait a minute. No, we're explorers. We're discoverers. What about the Kennedy speech? He says, we will do this not because it's easy, but because it's hard. He had charisma, and we're explorers. You know that speech in the joint session of Congress? Where he says, we'll put a man on the moon and return him safely to Earth? You know that speech? Go three paragraphs earlier in that speech. That speech was given six weeks after Yuri Gagarin came out of orbit. We didn't yet have a vehicle that wouldn't kill one of our astronauts for having going up in it. And Kennedy saying, we're going to go to the moon before the decade is out. Three paragraphs earlier, what does he say? He says, if the events of recent weeks are any... In Gagarin had come out of orbit. If the events of recent weeks are any indication of the minds of men everywhere, of the impact of this adventure, then we need to show the world the path of freedom over the path of tyranny. It was a battle cry against communism. The rest was fluff. War, I don't want to die, driver, money, driver. That's what it is. So, without the politics, nothing happens. I have, I don't like it, but I accept it and understand it. In fact, over that period, we lost practically every measure of scientific, of, of space achievement in a head-to-head -head contest with the Soviet Union. <coughs> we would finally go to the moon and we say, we win. <laughs> okay. Then we declare ourselves winners. But anyone who kept a scorecard along the way would show that we lost practically every other metric. The Russians had the first satellite, the first non-human animal, the first human, the first woman, the first black person, or someone from Cuba, the first space station, the longest time logged in space. The, they had the first um, uh, landers on Venus, the first landers on the moon. They had a rover on the moon while our astronauts were there. We were reactive to the Soviet Union, not proactive. Yet we remember ourselves as leaders.